What's going on? Miki and Nick here for another Hungry Couple Food Challenge. We are on our way to Pizza Mia, the Newburgh, New York location. They have a Highland location as well. We are helping develop a challenge, a large garlic knot deep pizza with fried dough, a dozen wings, and a two liter of soda. The pizza, they said a light one, um, is around eight pounds. It looks amazing on their social media pictures. What we talked about was half shrimp scampi with mozzarella sticks and half margarita pizza. So it sounds pretty outstanding. It's gonna be kind of nice to have a little bit of a half and a half too. So it's nice to have a little bit of variety. So I'll be assisting with the development process Nick will actually be doing the one, doing the demo, and hopefully demolishing that pizza. We're here. Ready to go. Let's see how this goes. Here. I'm Ryan, owner operator of Pizza Mia in New York. We're in the Newburgh location. We're developing a massive challenge. We're so pleased to have you guys. So Thank you. So it's about seven pounds of pizza, a dozen wings, and a massive order of fried dough. Awesome. Choice of two minutes. It looks outstanding. There's variety. We have two different types of pizza. Honored to be the first person to take this on by myself. So thank you, Ryan. Stay tuned. It's going down. <laughs> Beautiful. Looks like a pizza wreath. How are you okay, feeling? Guys, are you? Feeling hungry uh, and anxious and terrified. We have half margarita, half shrimp scampi pizza, garlic knot crust, huge order of fried dough covered in powdered sugar, buffalo wings over here, oh, and a two liter of soda, I almost forgot. So you're probably looking at about 14 pounds of food and liquids total. You can come down here, you can take on this challenge with a partner preferably, check them out, Pizza Me in New York. Food looks outstanding, I'm psyched to do this. Slightly terrified. I think my strategy for this one is going to be maybe working my way from the outside in, the opposite of how I do a lot of uh, pizza challenges. A lot of people will eat the center of the pizza and then leave the crust. The problem is, if you leave all this crust for the end, you still gotta do the fried dough, you still gotta do the wings, that's a lot of chewing. Probably periodically throwing in some sweet fried dough um, and getting some of those wings down. They do look crispy. These wings look legit. Decided to go all the margarita part pizza first and then the shrimp scampi it looks like so his strategy seems to be start with one type of pizza move on to the next instead of bouncing around for a variety will this pay off I think for, for two people it might be kind of tough still that's good yeah that's good that's 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 
possible. Yeah. And so Nick right now is just proving that it is possible. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> just a guy. We're only 10 minutes in. Oh, you clear all the garlic knots. I didn't see that. No. <laughs> I was like, the, the pizza's not moving. <laughs> I didn't even notice. Sitting like three feet away. <laughs> No, I thought you were looking at it because your hands were like greasy and you couldn't do it. I'm guessing he's not full, but his jaw's starting to give out. The girls are strong. The pizza is gone. Nice. Nick just has the, the fried dough and the wing glass in the challenge. A little bit more of the two liter, and this challenge will be complete. I, I, I got about 60 viewers on our Pizza Me page right now, and a lot of people are saying he was, he's not able to do it, and now they're using <laughs> the words because I've never seen it before. I love him, and I was nervous. You know? <laughs> garlic knots for a while but they're really good the garlic knots are outstanding yeah the shrimp scampi may not have been the best choice next to the garlic knots yeah because it's just over the garlic yeah they're yeah, garlic. Oh, like alone they're both really really good yes really good it's nice you've got a little bit of variety with the sweet fried dough afterwards yeah and i know it's the do Don't forget your celery, babe. <laughs> <laughs> He's more of like a carrots and ranch guy. I like the blue cheese and celery. Good job, babe. Ooh. Oh my gosh. That was just dessert. To the home stretch here. Easier said than done. <laughs> <laughs> Are those light and fluffy? Or lighter than warm?
34 minutes and 50 Woo! seconds. Woo! <laughs> you guys, I didn't realize this, but like these, I thought these were cheese shavings. I thought they were cheese, right? That is all garlic. Now I'm starting to understand why this was a little bit difficult for him. So all of these, that's uh, shaved garlic. That's delicious, but that was probably a little bit tough for Nick. So bravo to him. Come check out the challenge here at Pizza Mia in Newburgh, New York. Let him know that we sent you, and if you take it on, let us know how you did. Challenge yet to be named, but it was delicious. I want to thank Brian from Pizza Mia. Um, if you're in the Hudson Valley, if you're in Newburgh, if you're not in Newburgh, come over and check them out. We're talking four time winner of the best pizza in the Hudson Valley here. So come down, check them out, talk to Brian. Tell them the hungry couple sent you. Yeah, thank you very much. It's really a pleasure having you guys here. For having Amazing. Us. We'll be back. We will sure. definitely be back and maybe leisurely enjoying some pizza next time, at least for myself. And Miss Sudo will be taking on the <laughs> challenge. All right, guys, thanks for tuning in. We'll see you next time. Oh, that's different. Thank you guys. Uh, this is gorgeous. Yeah, we put out like 25 different every single day. Wow. Try to keep a nice variety going. Thank you guys. <laughs>